All right, you guys, I just got Grand Champion on the Hobbit pinball machine. And I'll be honest with you, I don't know exactly what's going on in this game. I didn't know exactly what the hell I was doing, but I guess I f figured out enough to, to get through. Look, this is one of those games that lets you spell a whole name so I can do Paul Maxi proper. Let me just do the space, and let's see. I think I get a free game, but to tell you the truth, I'm all tuckered out after uh, becoming Grand Champion. Let's see if we get any special things. Oh, yeah. Look at that fine text. Ooh, the dragon worships me. I just want a free game and grand champion. Whoa. I gave this game a good rogering, if you know what I mean. <laughs> I really took it to town, boys. I really showed it who's boss. There's a big cheese around here. So I like it, but this game is a little confusing. But mainly by hitting these buttons here, you activate lock, and then of course any pinball player knows you lock a ball three times, you get multi-ball. During multi-ball, you get jackpots. Limited edition 123. Whoa. I'm not a huge fan of the Hobbit series, uh, but uh, I'm impressed with this. And someone who is a fan of the series or the movie, I would think it's a must-play. But own for 15 grand? Don't know. <laughs> you better be a rich dude and better be sure it's working right. I just played a long game, like 35 minutes or something. It seemed like it was a pretty madam. Here's what happens when you start the game. Look at all this confusing stuff. There's all this stuff going on. There's like a map. There's just a lot going on. Well, alright guys, thanks for watching. I'm gonna pretty much wrap, play this last game, and that ends my pinball for today. Good day. Alright, see ya.